So just a little story from street evangelizing. Um, this happened about like two weeks ago. We were evangelizing about Little Park and uh, we were just making ourselves available. We had our, our little booth and we had signs for a prayer station and, and asking people if they need prayer. And it was um, towards the end of, of, the, of the session when we were out there, uh, a guy comes up and he's uh, probably about, he was a young guy in his, in his mid twenties, but he came up and he was, he was a tall guy. He came up and he was just like agitated, just like a little shaking a little bit, something was up. And uh, we asked him what was up and he says, oh, can, can you guys pray for me? And uh, so uh, I was like, sure, yeah, well, what can we pray for him? And what's going on? And uh, just from there, he just started sharing about like how he's been, how he's struggling, how he got into you know, uh, you know, argument with his family members and how he got jumped er earlier and how he lost someone uh, really close to him. And so we, uh, we prayed for him and I just prayed for God's peace and God's presence, um, for God to show him how much he loves him. And I just felt like the Lord just, just trying to just give me words of encouragement for him just to let him know how much God loves him and is with them. And, and so at the end of the prayer, like, you know, you could just tell he was like, he was like, he felt God's peace. He was calm and like, you know, he wasn't shaking no more. And, and that kind of just opened the door. Like, like he was just really open there. He just, uh, um, was able to share the gospel with him. I asked him like, oh, do you pray um, to go to church and stuff? And I just try, try to meet him where he was at, you know? And, um, and then just meet him where, he, where he's at, ask him questions to see where he's at so I can just encourage him um, to go closer to Christ. And, and I just, I shared with him a little bit of my testimony of, of coming to know Christ through scripture. And I, I gave him a Bible, a, a New Testament. I encouraged him to read the New Testament to get to know Christ through, through scripture. And, and, through, and, and through prayer, and um, I, at the end, also we, I got his contact just to, to follow up with them and, and just to encourage them to go to church and stuff. But it was, it was one of those contacts where you know you uh, it was just a great like a deep encounter, a God encounter with somebody, and at the end, like you you felt like so humbled, like wow, God, like I'm not worthy to share. You know your love your hope your salvation i'm not worthy to you know i'm a sinner you know who am i but it's like it, it is such a joy to, to to be able to share the gospel and to and to just encourage that that person to grow closer to christ and so yeah i'd love to invite you guys to come out to to to, to do the same christ calls us to do it um christ is with us and 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 you know, just making all, all you have to do is just make yourself available, and God will use you to, to, to bless somebody, to touch someone's heart, to, um, and just that two minute conversation can change someone's life. So, I just want to encourage you to get out there and to, and to make yourself available uh, for God to share God's uh, good news.